the yeah. one in Disneyland. And it's like now I don't have to go all the way out there. Say, do, we, do we blow them out of the water? Okay, so we got changed into the weather. It's like a little bit. There's a bunny. Once again, I've had like two clips now that I get distracted. There's a bunny. I will get distracted at beautiful Disney things and animals. Everyone knows this about me. These are facts. It's a really little bunny too. It's really cute. You can't see it now. It hopped behind that fence. So, the, it's like comfortable right now. I also brought my bigger sweater, but right now I'm wearing like my Disneyland shirt. It's perfect for January. Disney in Florida in January. Can't ask for anything better. <laughs> and now we're on the walk, so you literally come right out of the Best Western parking lot. They have all of the Disney Springs hotels, wherever you stay. I've showed this before when we stayed at the Disney Springs Resort. They have these gorgeous just sidewalks that you can go along. It's like a perfect area to walk over to Disney Springs. So our plan is we're going to Riviera and we're gonna go to Disney Springs and then use the bus transportation there to get on the bus to go to the Riviera Resort. Brand new resort, it just opened in December. We're here in January, so it's Open last month. Super exciting. I can't wait to see it. I've seen pictures and videos and everything looks gorgeous. That tangled mosaic that they have in the breezeway. They have a tangled one and a Peter Pan one. And hopefully, I would love if we could ride the Skyliner tonight. I got to experience it back in October and it's my new favorite form of Disney transportation. It's just like magical. It's the most magical flight. Okay, this is gonna be a good night. <laughs> super pumped, I'm super pumped. It's my Disney happy high. Yes, it really is a thing, it, is. it just kicks in. I literally just texted my mom when we were like walking out of the hotel and I'm like, I'm, I'm like, I'm, cause she knows, she knows it's like I go into the stage where it's like that first day getting there and it's like my Disney happy high that I just am excited about everything. It's, this is my pure bliss, I'm <laughs> so happy. So yes, going to Riviera, super pumped, never been there. And when we were here actually, when we rode the Skyliner and my last time that I was here was back in October, me and my parents were riding the Skyliner and one of the stops on the Skyliner is Riviera, but obviously it wasn't open yet. You could still get off there if you wanted to, but you just could, there was like a tiny little part of the ground that was open, not even like the main part where all the pretty stuff was. It was just like, you could get off there. I guess some people were getting on at that station because it is connected to Caribbean Beach. So there were certain rooms, I guess, at Caribbean Beach that it made sense for the people to go to the Riviera stop. So that was like the reason that it was like still functioning. So it was just cool that we were like on the skyline or we would like go through the Riviera. And I kept saying, I'm like, this looks gorgeous. I want to see it. So we're seeing it tonight. I love the twinkle trees. And look, hidden Mickey's. Disney Springs train. that thing it's like a giant snake and a lizard Aww. we are taking the bridge right now because look at this it's just so peaceful over here oh that view never gets old mm. and the sounds the sounds of Disney Springs that wants a picture big time Wow So pretty. And there's sprinkles. We love sprinkles. Look at this. Palm trees with lights. Oh yeah, baby. Something I always think about is one day having a house in Florida and 
putting Christmas lights on palm trees and it just like that thought right there makes me really happy it makes me smile. <laughs> and so I love seeing this and I think yeah you could definitely keep lights on your trees on your palm trees year-round if you do something cute like this I love it but then like during Christmas you could like wrap the individual palms if you want to get all the way up there in different colors red and green it'd be cute there's the Disney Springs water tower and look I spotted they have I don't think I've seen yet in person the new wraps of the buses the Pandora one just went past and now there's the Peter Pan and Tinkerbell one they're cute they're just so fun and Disney ish so photogenic I love that the palm trees and the Disney Springs yeah. water tower okay we need to figure out what bus the bus boards up here oh my gosh the Pandora one <laughs> that's awesome 21 Riviera Resort. I wonder what bus we're gonna get. That's something that's really fun about the new bus wraps is like they're always gonna be different so you can almost like guess like oh what bus are we gonna have. It's fun. <laughs> See this is just fun about having wrap buses. Okay we're waiting for the bus. We're getting super excited. We're talking about the plan for food. So something that I really want to try there is at the Bar Riva. Alyssa sent this to me on Instagram the other day and I had heard about this. They have the Monte Cristo sandwich which is supposed to be as good as the Disneyland one. Riviera Resort at Bar Riva, which is supposedly, I think it's like the pool bar, but it may also be like a lounge. I don't really know. We know nothing about this. <laughs> this is our first time going, so we're gonna find it. But there's also, I think, a restaurant like on the top floor. So we were like saying we could either do that or we could go to the bar. I don't know. We came up with a plan that we could ask if there is availability. And then that will be like the answer. It's like, so then we'll go do that. So, but I love the Disneyland Monte Cristo like so much. And it's, my absolute favorite thing and I've had Monte Cristo's other places and I get so disappointed because it doesn't live up to the Disneyland and this one the review on it is that it's very similar if not like the same thing as the Disneyland Monte Cristo so is this the bus I think this is the bus it's goofy it's goofy also the bus has Wi-Fi I don't think I've ever been on a Disney bus with Wi-Fi this is a new thing and it's awesome <laughs> okay we're here I it just hit me like I don't know when it would have been that it's like you get to go to a new Disney resort done, new ride openings and everything, but I don't think it I've ever like had that experience of it being like a brand new to me hotel. But yeah, that's just crazy to think that it's not every day, you know, that a new resort opens. So to be able to like walk up to this right now and it's a brand new place. This is just so cool. I'm so excited. <laughs> I didn't realize, I really didn't watch too many videos on this because I wanted it to still have an element of surprise. Look at this. Oh my gosh, pretty. Wow. Look at the hidden Mickeys on the balconies. I can see them from here. It's amazing. It's so pretty. Riviera Resort. Oh, I love this. Welcome home. We are home. Wow. Thank you. Oh, this is amazing. Oh. Wow. Oh, you can smell the fresh flowers in here. This is so pretty. Oh, Olaf is singing. <laughs> like a swanky version of Olaf. Okay, I've instantly been attracted to this artwork over here. I want this in my house. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That reminds me of like one of the like travel, like real colorful prints that they did in merchandise a couple years ago. Look at this. Okay, this was the first one that I'd spotted from across the room. Oh, cute. There's a little cafe. Oh goodness, going in the boutique. <laughs> we found the boutique. <gasps> and a Christmas ornament is the first thing I see. Oh gosh. I assume that's a Christmas ornament. Yes, you can hang it. Or just use it as a little picture. That's amazing. It has Riviera on it. Yes, and Mickey's. And Mickey's. What? Oh no, we shouldn't have come in here. We're gonna wanna buy everything. <laughs> yes. Unplugged and on vacation, baby. Oh, look at the stitch. Oh my gosh, that Dooney. That is stunning. I am in awe. This is amazing. 
I'm so happy right now. It's a new thing for me to explore and experience. I have some of the Skyliner merch here. Oh, look. It's the Funko Pop. I don't think I had seen that in person yet. It's so cute. They have these back in stock, the die cast. Cute. Oh, and the magic band. <laughs> Here's my first time seeing in person. These are now the mini, mini, um, look at that compared to the size of my phone, the mini, mini lounge flies. They are super cute, but for me, it's not functional. <laughs> One, just one. Just one yeah. Disney Resort to yeah. be, yeah, but that's a cute suitcase. Oh my gosh, did you see the back of it? Oh, that's, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Uh, that's cute. That is really cute. Oh, Magic Bands. Oh my gosh. I want to get like a new Magic Band. They have a Skyliner one. That's yet a different Skyliner one than the one that was over here. That this one, I love this one. It's like a teal blue one. Yeah, you can see they have all the Riviera merchandise. Look at the bathrobe. Oh, that picture has Disney ducks. Makes me happy. This, that's so nice. Little grocery, the sundries. I love that word, sundries. Mm. Cute beach bag, really cute. They're specialty plushes. Oh, they have the little keychainy ones. Mickey is a painter. Look at the little, oh, I would wear that in my size. It's a little kid dress. They have tassels on the bottom of them. That is just precious, that's precious. Oh my gosh, all this merch, the lounge fly. Yes, I do. Oh my gosh. That, I think that's the cutest lounge fly I've ever seen. Oh, there's an ornament. Okay, this is where my weakness will come in. I'm gonna wanna buy this ornament. They're heading off on a trip. And look at the aerial for a little girl. Oh, is that a coloring book that there's a Skyliner gondola? Okay, I'm, this is like, this is overload. Here's a puzzle. Oh my. Disney Mon Monopoly. There you go. Look at this. They have these touch screens so you can figure out. We want to go to Bariva. Okay, so it is by the pool. So we just got to go outside and oh, I'm so happy. I think that's all it does. I think it, it just shows you that that's how we, where it's at. It's awesome. Shops. Oh yeah, we found the yeah, shop. Found it is, it's like a boutique hotel. Really, that's a good way to describe it. I love all the marble. It's very, it's like a new age Grand Floridian. You know what I mean? It's like very Grand Floridian class. Yeah, I guess we just go outside here. I love it. Did you see, oh, I had seen this online. They have, I believe this is in French, the posters for the <laughs> yes. movies yes, written in French. Isn't that cool? <gasps> wow. It's so pretty. Oh, I need to see that tangled mosaic. I know that's in like on the way to the Skyliner, I think. This is so lovely. Oh, this, this is amazing. Wow. Look at that swing over there in the little chess courtyard. Oh, I hear fireworks. I wonder if that's Epcot. Oh, there's the Skyliners. It's dark, but I can see them moving over there. <gasps> wow. There's just so much room and space for activities. Look at that, you can just come sit here. They have a swing on this side too, and little tables. They have bocce ball, which is very different for a Disney resort. Fits into the theming, I love it. It's like those little unique things that just go with the resort. So let's walk on the turf. This, I'm in awe, I'm so in awe. Yep, so right down there is the Skyliner station. You can, it's dark, but you can faintly see that cable there and they're moving. They're going across. And so you're right in there, that right there is the tunnel that has the mosaics and I cannot wait to see that. Here is a pool. This looks like more of a quiet pool. I bet Bariva's over at the big pool, but that, I, if that's heated, I would get in there right now. I'm sure it is heated. Nobody's in it though. People, come enjoy the pool. Okay, here's the main pool. Hidden Mickey. 
Oh, that's a fun pool. I like the slide. Hmm. So this seems like it's more so the main pool because it has the water slide and everything. That's where I would be over at the relaxed, <laughs> quiet pool. Very nice. Okay, let's find Bariva. Oh yeah, look, they have giant checkers. Cornhole, look at that cornhole with the Riviera symbol. When have you seen a children's play area that has lighting effects like that on the water? That is next level stuff. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Those are like changing lighting effects. That's so pretty. This is the kids' splash area. And it's like so fancy. Okay, let's check out the pool. Oh, hot tub over here, the spa. They have a movie, it's Aristocats, down by, down by the pool here. Oh, pretty. I wanna stay here. <laughs> I wanna stay here so bad. This is really cute. Yeah, look at the hot tub. I want to get in that hot tub. <laughs> I really want to be in that hot tub. Okay, so we had passed it. This is Bar Riva right here, literally right by the entrance to the pool. This is why I was confused. I was like, okay, it's a pool bar, but yet it's like an indoor space at the same time. <gasps> they even have heaters. Nice. This is so cute. Look at this. Oh, those heat lamps feel good in here. They got heat for us. Oh, thank we just you. Stand somewhere or do we order up here? Oh, perfect. We do have the table. Oh, yeah, let's sit at the bar. Perfect. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, let's see the cocktails. Oh. This menu is absolutely incredible. We have a wonderful waiter who is letting us sample. Oh. So which one is this? This, this is, is the blood orange. Blood orange. Blood orange. Blood orange. Thank you so yeah. much. Oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> this cast, he's wonderful. He just like let us sample the drinks that we want to get. He recommended because I was already thinking that, that we said we want some money the And he said they're huge. So yeah. he was like, you know, just start with one and he said, one. and then we'll get you more if you want it. Yes. Wonderful. Wonderful service. Yeah. <laughs> I'm in love with this place, in love with everything. <gasps> Look at the coaster, I love it. See, so yes, this is the blood orange. It has the strawberry on top, the mint lemonade. Oh my gosh. It reminds me of like a mint cola. Oh, my gosh. oh that's good. Okay, everything's great. That is really good. Mm -hmm. oh, there wow. she is. Oh, I'm so excited. And what type of fries did he say this was? They recommended these fries. The frites, the palm frites. Okay. And we have a, what type of jam? This is strawberry, or raspberry jam. And then, oh. oh. Yeah, it is different. 
Well, they use the, uh, the blackberry and we use strawberry. Oh, so you're supposed to put the jam on it? Yeah, it's just been like a little bit of savory. Okay, we've come back into the boutique. <laughs> I am gonna get myself these guys right here because this is precious. I love this so much. So the Monte Cristo, oh my gosh. It was excellent, absolutely amazing, just like Disneyland. So now we are calling an Uber here. We walked around, just took all the pictures, took everything in at Riviera. It was like just a night full of Disney magic. It was like pure Disney magic. Getting to experience a new resort. I went ahead, I bought the ornament. I was like, I'm here now, it's my first trip. I'm doing it, I'm getting the ornament. <laughs> And so now we are waiting for a lift to come get us and we're going right back to the Best Western because we gotta rest up. We got a big day tomorrow. We're gonna do all resort hopping and go tour a ton of resorts. I'm really excited about it. And I realized when we came out here, you can't see it from this angle, but when we were walking over, that light fixture right there, it, in a certain way, you have to hit it at the right spot. It looks like a hidden Mickey. Super cool. Oh, this is awesome. I'm a Riviera fan. Back at the Best Western, we are exploring a little bit. And we just went in the gift shop and found a lot of things that we wanna buy. Sometimes it's funny, like in the off, well, this is an off property. This is a Disney Springs hotel, but you know, just like not owned by Disney. Sometimes they have like different things in the gift shop that are Disney mm -hmm. owned, like Disney merchandise <laughs> branded. But anyway, they have like some really different things in there that like there was a cute like key ring holder. And there was, I'm gonna get pop up a car magnet that I'd never seen anywhere else. So many cute things. I wanted to buy everything. But anyway, we now came out to explore. Here's the pool. And there is a hot tub, which is good to know. <laughs> it's way too late. We've had, been up for a long time today. <laughs> Driving all the way from Fort Lauderdale to here. It's time to go to bed. <laughs> so we're gonna go to bed. Let's go get some sleep so that we can be refreshed we in the morning. And also down there, they have like a sit down restaurant. Here they have like the little quick serve, Pizza Hut. Very nice. And look, this is what they had the advertisement in our room, the Toppers Crafted Ice Cream. I always love some good soft serve. Yeah, waffle cones. That's what we're gonna need to get at some point. Oh, they have the bowls too. Yeah, that's happening at some point while we're here. That has to happen. Oh, they also have little like, oh, that's cute. Oh, what is this? Spin to win something. Oh, that's cool. Super cute. Okay, we gotta go to bed. <laughs> Stacy! I'm really not fly. Seriously. So we'll be able to see Magic Kingdom. That's contemporary. So we can see Magic Kingdom in the far distance. So without further ado, let's do the must do at Oh, we missed them. It's nice. Oh, it's not. <gasps> this is why it's so late. Africa, Asia. Ah. Today is our resort hopping day. We are planning to go to a lot of different resorts. I've stayed at Grand Floridian. I've stayed at, not at Contemporary, but at Bay Lake Tower. So basically Contemporary, I'm gonna count it. <laughs> I have not stayed at Polynesian. So that's what I'm saying to that point. I'm like, I need to stay at the Poly so that I can, you know, have checked off all of the monorail loop resorts. <laughs> 